Hey coaches! Um, another topic that we are going to cover in this group today is personal development. So um, the third vital behavior or the second whatever one of the three vital behaviors is personal development, um, reading, listening to audio, um, sometimes I like to watch YouTube videos or just listen to them in the car, but personal development as a coach needs to be done every single day. The recommendation is um, 10 minutes uh, minimum, 10 minutes of reading, or you can do like 10 pages of reading. For me, 10 minutes is usually about five pages. Um, I don't know if that's a slow reader or I don't know. That's just what I've got out of it so far is that usually when I read for about 10 minutes, it's about five pages. So um, I am going to share with you, I made a video a couple weeks ago with my top 10 personal development books for new coaches or just coaches in general. You don't have to necessarily be new, but they're the books that I read um, when I first signed up and there was a few in this list that I and reading right now. So the reason why you need to be reading personal development, um, kind of like what I talked about in my, well, I guess I didn't post that video in this group yet. But anyway, I posted a video earlier in another group talking about um, getting discouraged a lot with this business. And you'll see that when you start talking to more people, um, not everyone is going to join you. Not everyone's going to say yes to joining your challenge group. Um, you'll probably get a lot of no's, but you'll, you'll get yeses in there as well. But it's easy to get discouraged with all the no's. And so reading personal development or listening to um, a book on audio, or however you do it, you want to do your personal development, however you do it, this is going to help you stay positive. This is going to keep you encouraged in your business. It's going to keep you filling up yourself with goodness so that you can be positive and you can be, um, you will be more, what's the word I'm trying to use? You'll be more successful in this business. I guess I can say, um, as long as you're working on yourself and keeping that discouraged level to a minimum. Um, I've noticed that when I don't read every day, like I literally have to read something or listen to an audio every day, because if I don't, I notice that when I hear no or when I hear someone isn't interested in joining my team, I kind of get... Um, I just feel like I'm doing something wrong or I'm not good enough. And when I read and I listen to other coaches or I listen to someone teach me to be confident, it just helps me it just helps me so much in so many different ways. So this is very important that you do. Um, I'm gonna share with you a couple of ways that I do it. I have the podcast app on my iPhone. If you don't have an iPhone, I really don't, I'm not sure what you need to download, but there's the podcast podcast app. It's already downloaded on your phone if you have an iPhone. Um, so what I did there, um, I downloaded, these are all the different podcasts that I have. Um, I'm not going to explain all of them, but one that is, is the Team Beachbody Coach podcast. All of the national wake-up calls that happen every Monday morning at 11 a.m. Eastern time are downloaded onto this podcast. So um, most of the time I can't listen to the calls live, um, so I will play the podcast and I'll just listen to it in the car, running errands. That's where I get a lot of my personal development done is in the car just listening to it on my phone. Um, I do try to read. I, I still read. I do both. I read in the morning or at night, and then I do the listening um, when I'm at home cleaning or in the car. Um, so podcasts. You can literally go into a podcast, the podcast app and just search like confidence or search... Um, I don't know, how to be a better leader, and tons of different things will come up and you can just download them and it doesn't take long or anything. You can just search whatever you, you feel like you need to work on. Um, one time I downloaded something to help me with scheduling my day. Um, so just try to use that. Another thing that I just got back into is Audible. This one right here, this is for you to read audiobooks online, or I'm sorry, listen to audiobooks. 
Um, you do have to pay for it. It's the plan that I have is $22 a month, but you get two books for that. So it's basically $11 a book and it's, um, you can obviously buy more books, but the $22 includes two books and then you can buy more throughout the month. But so far I haven't, I just downloaded Audible. Um, again, I had it before, but I wasn't crazy about having to pay for it. I didn't like that. I, I wanted to get it for free, but now I'm finding with having my son, it's easier for me to listen to things as to as opposed to sitting down and reading. So I kind of just caved and paid for it. And it's really not that bad. It's $11 per book for the first two. And then I, I don't know how much it is after that, but you can look into it. Um, but that's another way to get some personal development done. Another thing that I like to do is going to YouTube. Um, and again, I can do this on my phone while I'm driving. Before I leave the house, I'll usually pick a video that I want to just listen to. I don't watch it while I'm driving. Usually you don't need to watch them. They're just talking. Um, and I'll usually just play it as I'm leaving the house. And then I just keep my phone in my lap and I just listen to it on my ear earphones. Um, but YouTube, I will do the same thing as the podcast. I'll kind of just search for things. Um, most of the time, I do listen to a lot of other beach body coaches. But you don't have to do that. You can search, you know, personal development, kind of like what I said about the podcast, confidence, um, being a better leader, or anything, anything that you're struggling with, you can search for on YouTube. And I bet there is someone out there who has made a video about it that you can listen to or watch. Um, but those are my top three ways of getting my personal development in. And I can't stress to you enough how important it is. This is going to keep you feeling good and feeling confident and encouraged. And you'll be able to help more people um, when you are feeling good like this. So like I said, I will leave a link to the video that I made about my top 10 personal development books. And um, that's about it. So if you have any questions about this topic at all, um, feel free to comment and I will answer as soon as I can. Thanks. Bye.